While the Republic of Zambia, through the Ministry of Health, will Monday, 27th September 2021, be launching a heightened community COVID-19 vaccination campaign, where the ministry has planned to increase COVID-19 vaccination sites, including bringing them into the communities to allow for more citizens who have not yet been vaccinated to receive their vaccines, some Lusaka residents still believe COVID-19 vaccines are not safe for use on humans and still insist that they will not be vaccinated. Joseph Lubasi, a Lusaka resident, is of a view that COVID-19 is a fulfillment of scripture which states that in the last days there will be diseases that will not be healed. He and many others believe COVID-19 can only be healed by God and says he would rather die from the pandemic than be vaccinated. Yes, according to my own understanding, uh, this time around the devil has got some more powers and the devil is ruling at the moment. So basically as for me, I don't feel like you know, taking that vaccine as for now and I am not ready for that. Yes, because I believe in what the Bible says, in what the scripture says. If you read uh, Revelation, uh, although I've forgotten the verse, but if you read there, you know, what is there, it's about the mark of the beast. So I'm sure now this is the era, this is the period that you know we are in at the moment. So personally, yeah, I can encourage others to, to do that, but as for me, I'm not ready for that. I'm going to wait for my Lord. If it means to die from COVID-19, then I'm ready to die for COVID-19. Uh, I am already for others, COVID-19 vaccines are not important, hence the reason they see no point in being vaccinated. Not vaccinated, and reason being is that there are so many rumors going about it, and uh, and th th there's not much information about it. And so I, I was like, no, I can't vaccinate myself. Why? In case there's anything. People say there are side effects. Some people are dying after the vaccine. So all those things. I just say no. I'd rather just, uh, I'd rather just wear a face mask. I COVID-19. So I don't have to I don't have to I don't have to So but for Elliot Jerry, he feels vaccines are very important and says if given a chance, he will go and get vaccinated. It is, is coming from very far from Zambia. And for our government to acquire medicine from wherever it is coming from, there's a reason. And my, 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 my message to the, uh, I'm urging uh, our government to sensitize more uh, to the people of Zambia the importance of uh, vaccinations. Like me, I'm very mirroring and any day from now, I'm planning to go there and being vaccinated. You see, listen, we saw how, uh, how many people died. Our mortuary was full to the capacity. People, they were dying like a cockroach in the house. So why should we fear going there to be vaccinated? Uh, we literally wanted to protect our loved ones and ourselves, yeah? Because yeah. you know it's a very deadly disease. Uh, COVID-19 is real, yeah, like it's very... real, yeah. And so... make sure you get a jab. With all the information on the dangers of COVID-19 and how it can be prevented, some citizens still doubt the authenticity of the vaccines and one wonders if the Ministry of Health, the media, CSOs and other stakeholders have done enough to sensitize and convince citizens to get vaccinated. The response calls for more stakeholders such as the church to join the fight against COVID-19. Prudence Chota, reporting for Community TV News.